five tasty questions with the lovely Margaret Mandavi. Question number one, Margaret. Define your relationship with wine. Well, my relationship with wine is just that, you know, you turn a meal into a feast. You can have you can have a celebration every day. You can have yesterday's leftovers and a glass of wine and it gets better, right? <laughs> Uh, your favorite music memory, your favorite musical memory. Now, my favorite m musical memory was actually in Paris at the, uh, I think it was the uh, des Elysees, and we gave a concert celebrating Opus One. And it was conducted by Leonard Bernstein. And of course, the concert was magnificent. And afterwards, I sat with him drinking wine for a long time, just listening to a an icon telling about many many wonderful things who has been your biggest inspiration margaret my husband Barbara Mandari. uh cooking who have you enjoyed cooking with most well of course it was a great honor to have julia child in the kitchen who then also became a friend as i cook along i love to cook with my daughter annie who is kind of a fabulous chef and has also helped me write a cookbook. And that cookbook just came out, right? A little while ago. Uh, and lastly, Margaret, your last supper, uh, who'd be at the table and what would I you hope, eat? I hope my family and my friends. And we would have uh, uh, maybe a 74 Cabernet Sauvignon Reserve and a little pastina in Brodo. Beautiful. Can I pull up a chair? Oh, and, uh, no, I don't want you at my last. Oh. I want you before live, okay? Cheers. Where, where's your glass? Yeah. Where are we? Cheers, we Margaret. Again. Oh, wait, Lord. I keep, I can't, I keep on doing this. Last time. Here we go. Cheers, Margaret. Cheers. Much Cheers. love. Thank you.